So step 19 and 20 is going to be to create a bushing to add to the bottom of the base plate. And a bushing is kind of like a, usually a polyurethane or a rubber pad so that your skateboard kind of has some flex on it. So uh, we're going to rotate the model. So we're looking at the bottom and we're going to create a new sketch on this face right here, which is the, got to wait a second here, the kind of the larger rectangle here at the bottom of this um, whatever we call that thing, the assembly or something. Anyway, let's go to it. And so when we get there, we're going to need to create two circles and they've got to be centered on that bottom rectangle. And I'll show you how to do that. The directions here are a little bit confusing for that. And so uh, I'll model that for us. And so if we go to the bottom, again, we're creating a sketch on this plate right here. So we'll select sketch on this plate. We need a center point to circle. And we could try to eyeball the center here. It's not going to work. So what we want to do is come up here and get that kind of orange or yellow colored square right there. And then float over here and get that one. And then we have our yellow line. And then when we get the other yellow line, we've got to have both of those yellow lines showing for us to show us that we are in the center of the circle of that rectangle. And again, the way to do it to get this yellow box, do not click. Get this yellow box, do not click. Then when we come to the center like this, we can click, make a large circle, and we're going to make a second smaller circle inside of that. And so we need to exit the circle thing then, and we're going to put some dimensions on here. We want the dimension of the small circle to be 0.375 and the large circle to be one inch. So my dimension tool, again, just click the edge of the circle, 0.375. And the large circle, we want one inch. Okay. We'll be back with the next step.